Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, so today I'm gonna show you how I go about uh, changing the string to an acoustic guitar. And uh, yeah, I'm back in my hometown and I'm uh, about to build a music YouTube studio, man cave or whatever. But yeah, let's get right to it. Okay, so what we'll need for this operation is, of course, strings. I'm gonna throw some Roto Sound Jumbo King 11s and then a microfiber cloth to clean the guitar and uh, just make it uh, a bit wet on one end, it's perfect. And then uh, a string winder, very good to have. Uh, some type of paper, in Sweden we call it like nose paper, <laughs> I think. And yeah, it's for the lemon oil to clean the fretboard. And then guitar polish if you want, very good. And a regular cutter to cut the tricks. So we'll begin to by removing the old strings of course, with the string winder like this. Just, uh, make it loose. Careful not to stick yourself because guitar strings they are very sharp on the edges. And then I used to And then you take your microfiber cloth and just uh, paint the dry side first on the whole guitar. Depends on how much you want to clean the guitar. I uh, always would clean my guitars when I uh, change the strings because then you got to clean all the parts. Begin with the first board like this.
that. And then I take our new things. Oh wait, my fault. Before we put on the new things, we have to use this lemon oil. Fucking leak is a fucking mess. Like this, like uh, two dots on the paper like that. And then just rub it in like this. It smells really good too. Love it. You can turn it like that and we'll use the other side. Oh, and I almost forgotten to. I used to take some uh, graphite pen and used to fill in the where the swings sit in the nut, the boat in the neck, like here. It's uh, supposed to make it stay in tune better and uh, yeah I don't know how I do it and then you can't do it on an acoustic like this but on an electric you can fill in the, the nut back here as well so yeah let's take a new swings and uh, you can see at the back here which one of them fits there in the yeah, blue or the low E swing. Not so hard to find out what that is. And then you just uh, take this, put it against the, what do you say? Ring there in the string, and uh, yeah, so and then you push it right in, like so. Then you take this, and then I used to. Hold it like that, and I measure how much uh, windings I will get on each uh, tuning head by doing this. I grab the string on the first fret and just drag it about one fret, and that's about the perfect amount of windings for the low E string. And I just did that, taking it so, take the string winder and begin to tap. You have to press the air and uh, take your time and tune up because it shall not snap but it could make some noise and yeah, it's First swing ready, right now I'm going to do the rest. Alright, so now that we've got some new swings on this badass guitar, badass guitar, badass guitar, it's just a tune up. Yeah, by the way, I'm using one of those clip on tuners, it's very handy to have.
that's it for today guys, thank you so much for watching, and if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up, and if you have any questions at all, just ask them in the comment section below, and if you want more videos like this, like guitar covers, guitar setup, and guitar tech stuff, headdress stuff, vlogs, you name it, subscribe today, and I will be more than happy, and I will see you very soon in the next video, over and out.